Hey, how's it going YouTube? Today I have the Razer Goliathus Extended Chroma. So the reason I picked this up was because I originally got this like whatever kind of felt material mouse pad from Amazon and originally I didn't think anything of the quality when I was gaming and then I picked this little Razer mouse pad up for like five bucks on an Amazon sale day and then I realized just how much of a difference that kind of like glidiness actually came into play when you were gaming and it made me kind of think like why am I going to have two mouse pads on my desk with this little kind of ripple nub thing hitting here it just it didn't really mesh too well plus the rgb adds at least like i don't know 10 fps so it's got razor's micro textured cloth surface it's optimized for you know sensitivity and gaming rubber base and rgb chroma around the edges kind of simple it also gives you like a little area to like feel it there it feels pretty nice almost the same material as that but without further ado let's dive right into this this is quite the box nice classy razor braided cable here I really like that got those stickers on deck set up they give you a really big box i think because if you like try and roll this up at a certain like circumference too tight that it might mess with the leds so i'm gonna keep this box on handy or on hand just in case i want to store this or something like that but let's uh let's bust this bad boy out Okay, always a fan of Razer's packaging, very high quality cable here, USB-A. I did get this on sale for 40 schmackaroos, it's usually $60. Now, it also has a like, styrofoam kind of brace for it, just to make sure that you always store it at the right roll upage and on the inside you've got your documentation i am just going to plug it in and hope for the best here you can kind of see how the led strip looks around the mat and it's braided with that black stitching across this does come in this color, mercury, which is white, and quartz, which is honestly kind of like a gray with a pink little doohickey that attaches the mouse pad to your computer, this thing. I got the black, and let's do this for a dramatic effect together. Oh yeah. All right, let's get this bad boy enrolled. So I have seen some people having issues with this like not laying completely flat. Let me get some stuff off of my desk and let me uh, see how this looks. So as you can see, the mouse pad fits perfectly across my desk. This is just, you know, your standard IKEA desk. I have everything hooked up to Razer Chroma Studio. I also have it so it matches my HP Omen 30L. Sadly, the 30L and, you know, Razer Synapse don't work together. So I have everything kind of linked to this purplish blue theme and I have the mouse pad to just cycle between like a dark pink slash purple slash blue and one thing to really keep in mind here is that this entire ring around here 
is just one lighting zone. And honestly, that's kind of all you need because if you're gaming and there's like 30 different colors going around your mouse pad at once, that's just a little too, I don't know if obnoxious is the right word, but too distracting, at least for me personally. So you can go in here into Razer Chroma Studio and manipulate the color of this mouse pad pretty much however you want. Uh, you just got to remember that it has the one lighting zone. That is all I have for you guys. I just thought you may appreciate how it looks on my setup while I'm gaming. I think it adds a lot of ambiance and it really kind of just takes a desk setup to the next level, especially when you have other Razer products that go along with it. It's just really nice and sets the mood, if you know what I'm saying. If you guys liked the video, please leave a like, comment, and sub. Other than that, thank you for stopping by, and I'll see you next time. Later.